It didn't really make me too nervous because I felt like the chances of someone going into the water were pretty low. A lot of muscle, a lot of power. This is probably the most powerful crew I've ever had. I got to run a, a wave that I don't normally run. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. <laughs> we, uh, we hit this pretty big wave. The monster is the name of the wave. It was definitely the biggest wave of the day. It completely knocked me off my feet. We just got hammered. Ah! It kind of rocked me a little bit, and I lost my footing. Ah! And, and to me, it looked like everyone was there, so I just kept paddling away, paddling away. Next thing I know, I'm in the water, oh, under the water. Grab him, grab him, grab him. There was a point there where I was kind of gasping for air, and I wasn't sure what to do. Five, ten seconds there where I had to yell at them and they had no idea what I was saying. Craig, grab him, grab him, rescue him. I look back and Chris, Chris is nowhere to be seen. And they're like, what? Who? <laughs> oh. You know, I look up and I see Tim's face helping me up. It gives a huge tug and pulls about him looking down at me with that nasty mustache that's going on as well. It, it kind of was a little reassuring at the same time. You know, again, it, it slowly brings back a few memories from the crash and, you know, the first person I saw after we came to a stop was Tim's face. It was good. We made it. Most of us. <laughs>